Hey Capricornians, welcome to December 16th through the 31st reading. I apologize for a slightly late delayed, <coughs> excuse me, entry into the <laughs> uh, YouTube file here, but um, unavoidably detained. Okay, so we're going to talk about Twin Flame Soulmates for the end of the year, and then in the extended reading we'll see how it may flow over into the new year. And what are some of the clarifications for some of the ones we have questions about? Uh, want some more information. Okay, we'll do that in the extended. All right, so one more here. <clears throat> All right, here we go. All right, Capricorn. Somebody else got this as the bottom. Ten of Swords. Eek! Ten of Swords can be Surrender. It's also the last card. <clears throat> excuse me and it's so like nowhere to go but up right and the sun is coming up so this is finishing a cycle right it looks awful <laughs> looks like it was kind of an awful cycle you do realize Capricornians that Saturn is coming back into Capricorn at the end of December <clears throat> and that's where it belongs so you'll be very happy with uh, your home your planet your ruling planet at home moving forward so here we go. This is about love and twin flame. Okay. Okay, okay. <coughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> I'm so sorry. Okay. So the Capricorn friends, you have been waiting. You have been waiting and your wish is going to be granted. This is your gift that is happening at the end of this year. This is going away. Whatever has been plaguing you, because look, the universe is saying you have been through, you have been through it. Okay? You have been through it. <clears throat> so you have been through it and that has created strength in you. You are now uh, a more formidable opponent you are now very, very um, powerful in a feminine sort of way, like uh, internal power and strength, and that just comes through you, right? That just comes through you. You have been waiting for this. This has been a long time coming. You have been <clears throat> awaiting your person, and you have been through it. You have been through it. You have been through um, struggles. But the cool thing is, is you really built a good foundation. And of course, Capricorn, you are always <clears throat> building foundations. And you've come to the, happily, the end of this cycle. And you're ready to see what the sculpture looks like, right? You've done a lot of hard work here. In your house, in your um, allies, <clears throat> Hierophant, meaning a union. Uh, the relationship is now moving from a phase of casualness. <coughs> I'm so sorry. Casualness to um, something more. You're moving into something more. You're leaving that other cycle behind. You're taking with it the good things and you're leaving the other stuff behind. So the communication you're having is all about <clears throat> back and forth. You could be seeing somebody on the internet. This could be a new person in your life. Brand new person. There are some struggles, but it's nothing like this. Nothing like that. This is like, oh, would you like tea at four? No, I think I'd like it at 4.30. Oh, okay. Like that's what that is compared to that 10 of swords. No worries, right? In your near in your near future, I'm sorry, I turned that off. Um, King of Pentacles. So this is your person, Capricorn. This is your soulmate, someone who is highly evolved, <clears throat> very um, stable. You have been talking to them for quite some time. You know who they are. This is not a new. <clears throat> arrival. 
this is something you have wished for, something you have waited to come to fruition. The outcome card, nine of cups, your wish is granted. The out, the uh, uh, universe uh, advice is that you're going to win. All right. So just relax, just chill. If it hasn't quite come together yet, it will by the end of this year. That's really nice. A little bit, little, <clears throat> little bumps. Okay. Little bumps in the road. Nothing like you've already experienced. You can handle this. You got this. All right. You got this. In the extended here, uh, uh, <clears throat> there's a little bit of protection. Okay. Look at Queen of Swords looks like she's holding a gun. I don't know if you feel that way. All these three cards look like they're protecting themselves, don't they? So this past experience that has been so difficult is causing you, it's a little bit of a nine of wands, uh, you know, sort of like protecting yourself. But this is your wish come true. This person, earth energy, just like you, right? This is your, um, your soulmate, your even match. They are here. So <clears throat> we're going to um, see how this plays out. We're going to get some cards for some energies around where we're going here. What's What you're going to have to navigate because the wish has been granted, but there's still a lot to do. There's still a lot to do here. It's not coalesced. I don't see, what I do see though is that union is here, right? This is a, this is an earth plane like a marriage, right? Like it's not like just this dreamy soulmate. We're connected spiritually. Not that that's bad. <clears throat> it's just not, this is earth, but this is you Capricorn. This is earth based. All right. Okay. So I will see you on the other side and we'll do some more extended information about what's going to happen. All right. We'll see you over there on Vimeo.